Managing projects and departments in Meeting King. If you have only one meeting a week and create very few tasks, there's no need to organize your information by project or department. If, however, you manage a more complicated organization and work on various projects and with different departments, Meeting King can make it really easy. By clicking on this icon, you can manage and create your projects, departments and tags. In other applications, you may be used to folders and from a navigation point of view, there are some similarities. But this is much more powerful. For example, many meetings and tasks often belong to a project and to one or more departments. With projects and departments, you can also define a team that belongs to that project or that department. This helps you to organize your information, but also provides an easy way to share and collaborate. Okay, before I explain how to create projects and departments and tags, let me show you the value. I can close the left panel simply by clicking this icon or click the grey out area here. Normally you see all your meetings and tasks and in the calendar as well. But in most cases, you want to look at one project or department or a combination of various departments, projects and tags. So I open the filter and I choose a project from the project list. Uh, let's choose the opening of the restaurant. And it gets added to the filter. I can also place my cursor here and then I get a list of recently used projects, departments and tags. If I type, suggestions will come up. As you can see, the projects are in orange and have the letters PJCT and 3P. So that means it has three members. Departments are green, the DEPT abbreviation and there are three members to this marketing department. And finally, tags are blue. On the right you'll see that the information is updated on the fly. So let's see, I have opening restaurant uh, in Amsterdam and the sales, what needs to be done for that. The filter now applies to all these three pages. If I remove one of them, now I only see that. I can remove them simply by clicking the X. To make it even faster, you can also add the filter right from the meetings and task pages and the calendar page as well. Simply click on a project or a department under a task or a meeting and it will be added to the filter. I can do the same thing with a person. So switching back and forth and making combinations has never been so easy. So. How do you create new projects, departments or tags? We open the left panel and I can expand these by clicking on it and when I hover over it, you see the plus sign and the settings icon. When I click the plus sign I can simply create a new project. So let's create a sample project and I have to add a member to it. Well, let's do James Make him a member of the sample project. If you don't add a member, it becomes a regular tag. So now I have the sample project. If I want to edit a project, simply click on the project and you can edit the members. There are other ways. You can also edit a member simply by clicking here and then you have this one as well. Normally tagging is a lot of work, well not in Meeking King. For example, if you are working in project opening restaurant Amsterdam, well, let's open that one, opening restaurant Amsterdam, and I add a task there, this task will automatically become part of this project and will be visible to all three members of this project. The same thing if I create a new meeting here, that meeting will become part of the project 
And you get the question whether the members, the participants, the members of this project should also be part of the meeting. If I select one person not to be part of this meeting, then the information in this meeting is not visible to that person. Of course, you can always add and remove ta tags and projects and departments to all your tasks and meetings. We hope this helps you to manage your organization more efficiently.